guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Nana Marie here, and in today's video, I'll be getting a bunny. So, if you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, and turn on that little notification bell right next to the subscribe button. So, please enjoy. Hey guys, so now I'm going to do a mini haul of the stuff I got for my bunny. So, the first thing I got is a water dispenser, which is really cool because... When it's when the bunny finishes the water, it knows to fill it by itself. So that's really cool. The next thing I got is a, is a hay feeder. So you put the hay here, and you put the pillows. It's a bit dirty because there is toys in here. So yeah. Next, I got um sticks. I think they're apple flavored. I'm not sure, but yeah. So they're good for bunny's teeth when they chew on it because sometimes they're teething like dogs so they're good for them and yeah so the next thing i got was this toy it's it's pretty cool actually my dog tried to play with it it's like it looks like rubber bands but yeah that's what it looks like this is another toy my dog tried to play with it's like a big chunk of log then a tiny chunk then a big tiny chunk and it can hang from something but i don't think it's gonna hang i think it's just i think i'm just gonna like let her play with it okay so i also got pine cones for their toys and they're really cute because they're really tiny this next toy i got this big one just like this one but bigger and a rope and then i got a star that looks like that i got a litter box so this litter box my mom ordered it puppy pad so when so you slide this tray out and you put it in and then you put the puppy pad in the tray but the thing is about this litter box there's like these things so i put like i'm gonna put a towel on it until we get a new one which probably will be for a while because yeah we just got it and we need to make use of it but yeah i'm probably gonna put like a thin towel i need to find a thinner towel than i have to put this on so this is what it looks like use this litter box to use the bathroom just like cat to pet cat it's 8 11 so we're probably gonna set up the cage tomorrow and it looks pretty hard but it probably will be easy so yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow or later today i'm not sure mostly tomorrow so bye guys Hey guys, guess what came? It's the cage. Okay, so it's supposed to come tomorrow when the bunny comes, but you know, it can't really. So, I'm gonna open it. Wait, I can't go that deep. Okay. okay, I know I need help. I'm gonna take out the pieces and then I'm gonna like lay it down and then we're gonna start videoing and putting it up together. So yeah. Guys, look at all these pieces. It's gonna be huge in that tiny little space. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to building it and not. I'm just looking forward to see the finishing look. So I can put all this stuff on here and finally get the bunny tomorrow. So, yeah. Okay, hey guys. So this is the bunny's cage slash hutch. And my dad built it, but I was so excited that I forgot to film. Sorry about that. So I'm going to give you guys a little bunny hutch slash cage tour. So let's get started. Okay, so first, there's this little latch you can open, which is super cool and super convenient. And then the first thing you see is this um, hay feeder. You put hay here and then the pebbles, which is really convenient, like I said. And it's really cool that you can tie, like you can like screw it into the, I forgot, I don't know what he's called, but. And then you, and then you have the water bottle, same thing that you can screw onto this. But it's really cool is that when when the, the water bottle knows when the bunny's like when it's not full anymore, so it real fit, it refills by itself. And then you have the litter box. It has the same screw thing, but it was too big to do it, so we didn't do it. 
Then we have this toy. I don't know if you guys can see it, but that brown toy back there. It hangs from this thing, wires, I guess. I don't know. So yeah, so she can play. And then we have this little ramp where the bunny where the bunny climbs up in to get to this. And this looks it looks small, but it's huge because you have this other half. And it comes in and this is probably where the bunny's gonna sleep and hang out. Have fun. I put some toys up here and this thing can open so I can get the bunny in the morning or at night easily and just grabbing her like that so and also this cage you can pull it in and out oopsie it's really convenient and this one too and also there's rollers so you can roll it for places so yeah so after this we're probably gonna eat lunch and then go get the bunny so i'll see you guys walk into the car right in the car so bye guys hey guys so we're getting the bunny right now i'm so excited let's go Bunny. So she's still a little jumpy because she's a baby. Okay. The closer you hold her to you, the better she will be. Let me hold this. Wanna check her out? Yeah. <laughs> oh wow. She's so cute. What do you think? Yeah, look there. He's recording you. <laughs> <laughs> she's very cute. Her birthday was November 4th, so she's freshly eight weeks old. Oh, November 4th. Yeah.
to swap leg out and everything. Oh my goodness. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys love this video and I'll be doing more videos like this coming up soon. So make sure you guys stay tuned. And the name reveal for my bunny is da, 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 Chesapeake. Um, yeah, I named her Chesapeake because I've always wanted a bunny named Chesapeake. I don't know why, but I feel like she has the right color for the name Chesapeake, and I love her so much. So stay tuned because I'll be doing an update on Chesapeake so you guys can see how much she's grown and how if she's changed a little bit. But yeah, like I said before in the intro, if you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, and turn on this post notification bell. And I'll see you guys soon in the next week's video. Bye, Natalie out.